Well, since the challenges are over, it only made sense to keep the vlogs going. Yo, I decided to call these vlogs My Fit Life. Since I'm being fit and you're following my life. Yo, so the armored truck took the party bus to the next level, y'all. There's people actually on that armored truck party. The limo service headed over to um, the actual awards. They got champagne. I love YouTube. <laughs> They take really good care of you here. <laughs> got Treasure Island right here, y'all. If you ever come to Vegas, my, I've never been to Treasure Island. Have you been there? Oh, yeah. It's crazy? Yeah, for sure. Hey, man. Pleasure meeting you, okay? No doubt. You too. Go hit this award show up real quick, y'all. Y'all see I got the champagne. That's the uh, YouTube car service right here. They pick you up. We get we get door-to-door -door service because that's how we roll. Now, I'm going to go in here and I'm going. we're going to shut it down real quick, all right? Let's do it. Summer, so I have to go. They're grilling meat on the stone. That's a 700 degree stone, though. I would have wanted to. I think he said it's like 700 degrees. I don't know. I mean, do you see the steam coming out? I just want to believe it's 700 degrees for the vlog. It's 700 Touch degrees it. stone, y'all. Oh my god, your hand will sear off. Alright, here it goes. We're going to paint the rock 700 degrees with oil. And the sad part, y'all, is as I see him cook this meat and Andy smiles, I have to sit over here and just be look, look sad. Good morning, people. Woo! Last night, trust me, you don't want to know. I got my emergency right here because we were out crazy partying. But if there's one thing I learned about daily vlogging, and you can take this to your grade, folks, Whenever you daily vlog, never show the party, because they'll always want the party. I figured I'd stop at CES before I go back, since I'm in Vegas. I might as well. Oh, she's cute. I think I'm going to go in as Joe Pinna today, since I don't have a badge. <laughs> you don't think I'm crazy. Maybe I am. I'm back home, back with the good camera. Can't you tell the difference? Today, I'm not gonna work out that hard. What we're gonna do is we're gonna do something for our core. An apple with no core would just be sauce. Your core is basically your trunk. It's like the trunk of a tree. If you don't have that trunk, that tree gonna just fall over. Something has to support those branches. This is what we doing. I'm about to go to bed, don't laugh at my boxes. Boom, hit our plank. As you get stronger in your plank position, you can lift one leg up. You might say, okay, I mastered one leg, they storm, what do I do next? Then you can lift one arm. Put that arm out in front of you. Hold that position. Whew, I'm really feeling that. Then you might say, I mastered that. Then you can alternate arms and punch. Now that will really tighten your core up right there. Then you might say, okay, I mastered that. Now this is the next level stuff. You can do an opposite hand, opposite foot. Boom. You hold that position right there, then you know your core tight when you're doing that. You hold that for like 10 seconds. What? A question of the day comes from Nick Proco Music. He says, hey, they storm. I've worked out using P90X and I completed it. I'm not a big guy, but I'm not skinny. I want to be skinnier with the muscle I have now. What's healthier? Add more muscle so when I lose weight, I still have muscle or lose weight and muscle and then add the muscle back. Well, Nick Proco Music, you have the same problem a lot of people have. They start doing so much cardio because they want to burn that fat that it gets to the point where they start burning muscle also. And they're like, oh no, I don't want to lose this muscle. I just wanted to lose the fat. If you're doing fast and fast, high intensity intervals, you will still be able to burn the fat and keep your muscle. You want to make your repetition and your intensity high, but the distance and the time low. Thank y'all for joining the powerhouse. I will see y'all tomorrow.